guys, so massive rebranding reband- cam- campaign here at the Fun Soap, right? Yep, we're trying to up our game a little. Oh, you guys, I, I like it. I like what you did. And you guys actually put a lot of this out for people to see and kind of vote on it, didn't you? Yeah, we, we, we got hooked up with Procter & Gamble on a project that they helped us out a little bit. During that time, we met a couple different, um, like, package design companies, branding companies. And they took a look at our stuff, and we all agreed that we needed to uh, freshen things up a little bit. So the company that's actually developed this package does um, Mick Cafe, like McDonald's coffee drinks. They do Hall's cough drops. So it's a it's a pretty decent sized company, and they're giving us this fresh look. But yeah, we had like a thousand people vote on uh, what direction we should go with this. Uh, and you know, this is me. I'm a peppermint guy all day. You know that, right? Yeah, everybody has kind of like their favorites. I've been original for 15 years. I don't use much anything else. I don't see him. I don't see it changing, right? No. Okay. So something we're actually going to talk about one of your new lines, um, your acne line, right? We're going and then this antifungal is just a year old now, right? Antifungal is doing really good. Yeah. I mean that's that's really doing a, a nice job for us. I really wasn't. I didn't know how that was going to go. It's the first ever FDA registered antifungal bar soap. Long as far as we can find, we search and we have never found another one. But it's actually registered with the FDA. It's an over-the-counter medicine. Uh, that thing's taken off. We were really surprised by that. Um, then the next FDA one is, is our acne care. Yeah, and that that one is one that uh, you know I'm obviously super interested in. That I mean. That. And, and there's some nice. there's some partner products that are coming out with that like uh, this is not wrestling related it's, it's other stuff but it's like um, spot treatments and uh, moist uh, moisturizing creams I don't know what they are but they're all being developed right now. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, it's stuff that the girls use. So I'm, I'm not up on that. <laughs> but I think it's necessary. I think you need that, right? Yeah, I'll, I, I mean, think that's good. I mean, I get so many requests for. Um, why don't you make something for the women, which our soap is unisex. I never said it was for guys, but um, this this acne line will probably be more toward the women. Okay, so when will people start seeing these packages coming into the mail? When will they start seeing the new branded product? When will it hit the mail? When will it hit people's homes? The first one they'll see will be the acne bar. That That's in production as we speak. As a matter of fact, we've been holding up production on that to get this package complete. The final round of the package is done, and now it's at the printer. Okay, so these ones will be coming to like if someone orders something in October, they're probably going to get new packaging of the original and peppermint, right? Yeah, that'll as I as I go through my current stock that I have, you know, we make seventy five thousand bars at a time. So in order to just switch in the middle of something, you know, that's a lot of boxes to throw away. So we'll, you know, if I repackage them all, so we'll just go through it. But that's a couple months. So. People this season are going to be getting, that's what the package yeah, will start definitely like. by the season, they'll be starting to, to get that package. We didn't want to lose our our defense, um, our, our lineage, or our, the line of the, the product. So we, we kind of built it out of the old defense one. It might not look, you might not think it looks like it, but there's actual progression that it went through to get to this box. Yeah, I'm excited, man. I'm really excited.